Hey, Empire, TQ, Blue, y'all need to put together and come with my shit, bro. Like, real talk, man. Y'all know I wouldn't know. Y'all know I'm CEO. Y'all know my fucking signature got fours. Come with my shit, bro. You know? Y'all got it, nigga. Come, come, come with my shit, bro. Like, you know? Come with my shit, bro. Straight up, bro. I'm finna file another fucking lawsuit on Beat Bread, too. Beat Bread. Yeah, y'all went got money from Beat Bread, too, nigga. Nick, what's the catch? How can Beat Bread fund all of these music careers and not lose all of their money? What's in it for them? There's no catch, but here's the deal. This is an advance, meaning you're giving us a share of your streaming revenue in order to access funds sooner than you would otherwise have them. While there is a small fee added on your recoupable amount, no, this is not a loan. There are no penalties, no late fees, or interest on your deal. And the amount you owe will never go up. Niggas, bro, run me my check, bro. Run me, run me my shit, bro. I ain't gonna keep on asking y'all, niggas. Run me my shit, bro. Y'all could have came to me, bro. I would have got more money out, guys, bro. Guys, it was already paying me for Mo3 album, bro. Me and Mo3 album. We was in business together, bro. I would have got more money from that motherfucker, bro. I would have got more money from that motherfucker, bro. Come on, man. Y'all, y'all, y'all. Y'all kick me out, bro. Pay me my money, bro. Everybody knew what was going on. Come on, man. They think I ain't got enough money to fight them, bro. <laughs> That's what they think, bro, you know. They think I ain't got enough money to fight them, bro. They trying to stall it out so I keep paying lawyers 100000 every three months and shit. That's nothing to me, bro. I make that shit a weekend, bro. I just made two this weekend, bro. 200, bro. Like, I'm a fucking hustler, bro. Like, I'm gonna fight forever for my shit, bro. I'm standing, standing 10 toes down, bro. Nigga, I'm, if I gotta pay a lawyer 100 every three months, that's what I gotta do, bro. That's what I gotta do, bro. Like, I mean, I, a lot of people tell me stay off the internet with this shit, but I can't, bro. This shit on my heart, bro. This how I fight back, bro. If I didn't go to the internet, nobody will know what's going on, bro. It's the only way I can fight back, bro. It's the only way I can fight back, bro. Shit crazy, bro, like... I'm losing my mom and everything because of this, bro. My mama taking his, always going to take his side. It don't, don't matter. It's been like that since we was kids, I guess. We different people, bro. I guess, you know, I'm the strong one. I guess you feel like that. But my mama, you know, my mama on his side, bro. You know. I ain't even like this nigga that forged my name, like. You know how them first child is, man. You know how the first child is with a mama, bro. You know. This shit sad shit that broke up my family, bro. Like, I don't give a fuck what my mama say. You think this lawsuit is getting dropped, you got me. Hey, shit, I don't give a fuck what kind of say. I'm full of throttle with this motherfucker. Don't do that to you, but you got enough money. 
got me fucked up, man. Straight up. I'm full throttle, baby. So look, she gonna be on that side of the cold room. You see what the fuck I'm saying, guys? And bro, you see, this shit done separated a family, bro. This shit done separated a family, bro. A woman I love to death. But Taquari is her, is her, it's her first child, bro. It's, it's her first child, bro. I go to jail. She ain't gonna worry. She just gonna she she know I'm a I'm a stand up. You know. You know my mama straight on his side. You know. That's her oldest child. That's her baby, bro. That you know. That's her baby, bro. I'm standing on our business. I wouldn't give a I'm not listening to her. I wouldn't give a damn if God came down here and sit in the passenger side seat and said, drop this lawsuit in the name of Jesus. Fuck no. Yeah, bro. I'm losing my relationship with my mother, bro, because of this. All she's thinking about is him, bro. She ain't thinking about my kids. This is my kids' money, bro. I'm straight, nigga. I'm straight, nigga. My kids finna get this money. I'm putting this shit in the trust for my kids, bro. Like, nigga, y'all, man, I'm losing my fucking mama, nigga. I'm standing on all 10, dog. I wouldn't give a fuck. That's her oldest child, bro. That's her. No, I guess she don't look at him like she look. She look at me like a soldier, bro. I don't know, but it is what it is, you know. I'm full throttle, bro. I'm I'm full throttle. I ain't bagging down. Bro. Oh, my first deal was with uh with. My first deal with Boosted Label. How much he give you? Well, I, I mean, get, I ain't getting, I ain't getting none. It's just I ain't, publicity type yeah. shit. Yeah, like I ain't. Wait, how old you was, you, was you then, though? I mean, cause that matters, right? That matters. Yeah, I, was I probably young. was like, I probably was like eighteen. I think I was like eighteen. Yeah. And Boosie, you probably looked up the Boosie at that time, maybe? Hell yeah. Every, yeah. I know that I did. That was my favorite yeah. artist. I was like, hell yeah, shit, I'm signing the Boosie. I was like, hell yeah, I'm signing. It's Boosie. open. Oh, I was about to say, um, so yeah. like. So like yeah, that's crazy because like I would think outside of that then yeah right yeah. your first real deal because I guess that's like that's still yeah so when I signed with Boosie we signed a joint venture with Columbia like mm -hmm. six months uh six months later and um I mean I think I got I think I signed them like like one fifty I end up getting like fifty thousand of that wait how what the fuck. Cause I had like I was who we signed a joint venture. Okay, so, so it got to go to the the yeah yeah first, yeah you got to go the to niggas the niggas that signed you and then yeah, yeah for sure. damn so all right so fifty to is it like three or like percentages like how does that like I'm trying to know the numbers uh, I'm I'm, I'm with looking the percentages at, yeah so how you get how you end up getting fifty shit I don't know I think probably like uh, Boosie and Boosie brother split it oh, they, okay they so split the other hundred. Oh okay. yeah, it was, it was, cause Boosie brother brought me into a badass. Like he the one that found me and brought me to badass. Okay, you know what I'm saying. And then, you know, Boosie was kind of just you know the 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 face of it. But I was signed to. I really was signed to uh, through TQ. Okay. Yeah. Yo, how was that, bro? Think about like looking up like just again. We could, we 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 both share yeah, that. Yeah. Like Boosie was like. He still yeah. is like the godfather of my city. Yeah. I'm from Boston. Like he yeah, yeah, feel me? Yeah. But coming from being a fan yeah. to walking into the business, yeah. how was that experience for you? Like, how was it? I mean, I mean, like I said, like once you get older and start like seeing certain things, like, you know, a lot of time business can't fuck up a lot of shit. Like, that's, you know what I'm saying? True. 
you know, but like I said, I always tried to, I always tried to uh, just, you know, keep the best relationship I, I can, but you know, so a lot of times, you know, business, uh, you know. Get in the way of that sometimes. Yeah, it get, in, it get in the way of that sometimes, so. Dropped off the motherfucking bag, nigga. Big CEO, bitch. Yeah, Young Blue just gave me a hundred KK. Yeah.